ho 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 we got a video what's up guys welcome to another video and let me just say yoi me up looks kind of good if you guys want to see i'm um, it's probably going to be on your screen right now that's yoi Mia's whole trailer thing and she looks really she looks cool as a character and i feel like she fits the role very well with her whole um firework type thing and i'm kind of excited to see what they do with her what i'm seeing from this screen is that she has different types of elemental skills and the whole elemental burst doing like fireworks but i didn't see much from the elemental skill sort of like deal look type ordeal where after you do your elemental skill your normal attacks uh, or your auto attacks do flame damage and i feel like that's pretty cool I feel like that's what Fischl should have been. If you guys haven't seen Honkai Impact X Genshin Impact collaboration, every bow, every arrow that Fischl fires is electro-infused. I feel like, you know, in the game Genshin Impact, she should have had that. <laughs> and yeah, maybe Yoimiya has that. You know, maybe Yoimiya has that particular thing. And if it does... You know how crazy that will be for comps such as Ganyu and Yoimiya in the same team? Just Ganyu, Elemental Burst, Elemental Skill, swap out real quick and put Yoimiya in, then start doing, you know, melt damage and just put her crit damage to 200%. It's fine. It's fine. Either way, it's melt. Either way, it's gonna do a lot of damage. And I feel like that's kinda nice. So she looks really fun, especially her whole animation style, her whole demeanor in a sense. It looks super cool and I'm probably going to be summoning on her on my free to play account. But I'm going to be skipping her banner just for the sole reason as I talked about yesterday. I want ball. <laughs> I really want ball for so many reasons. Um, reason number one being she's an archon that destroys everything in her path. What What's cooler than that? And reason number two is, uh, I can't really talk about that. <laughs> uh, it's a joke, obviously. Anyways, it's really exciting what Genshin is doing to kind of hype up the characters, make them look good on screen. And you know what? It makes a lot of sense that they're doing that. But I do hope that what they show on screen isn't just for show. It's kind of, you know, show and tell. It shows us what they do. And obviously, as the characters are about to come out, they're going to show us the patch notes and whatever it is. But please, please, please help these characters out. Don't just give them high damage numbers. Make their kits useful. Make their elemental skill, elemental burst work together well. And make them properly fit into a team rather than, ha, I get 500% attack bonus for doing X amount of damage. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Um, not... I, I forgot to tell you about this artifacts there is two new artifact sets and i feel like one of them will be kind of decent for yoimiya especially because this artifact set has 50 percent so yeah 50 percent attack bonus that's kind of a crazy in every way shape or form aspect because this gives it to normal attacks and just imagine that bonus gets added with yoimiya's skill that infuses the you know, auto attacks with fire or pyro, if that's the case, it's gonna be pretty nice. And I feel like a lot of potential is being brought up to exactly that point. Not to mention, she also has this weird, um, after she charges her shot or something like that, she has a few fireworks around her that kind of fire at the, after she fires the first shot, they kind of follow suit. And it's like a homing missile, that's what I've seen at least. And it looks pretty cool. I'm kind of hoping it's not what Yenfei has. Yenfei has her whole like sigil situation in which the sigils do more damage if you do a charged attack. Please don't let that be the case. It probably is going to be ca the case because I just I just don't want to see that happening because it, if that character Yoimiya has the sigils, it's not going to be particularly fun if you just you know auto 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 and then the charged attack for example ganyu um i don't have ganyu myself but i've seen a lot of people use ganyu especially in all their team compositions and spiral abyss or whatever it is he's cool because the elemental skill or your elemental burst and then use the elemental skill and then you charge the attack and that's it there's no 
charge attack buff, right? There's no, oh, you have to press elemental skill and elemental burst to get some sigils to do your charge attack. That's not the situation. And I feel like it's going to be kind of wasted potential if they just make her do that. It's kind of unfortunate, but I really have high hopes for her. She looks super cool. She looks super fun. And I cannot wait to roll on her banner, especially for a free, not free, but another four star character that's going to be new on her banner. Two new characters on one banner. It's kind of in, an interesting situation. What do you guys think about that? I'm kind of excited for Sayu for the sole reason that Lily Pichu is actually the voice actor uh, for Sayu. It's, I mean, that's pretty cool. Um, like having a Twitch streamer be in the game, really fun, really cool. Especially how like you have Aether kind of doing, you know, YouTube. I saw that. But, you know, a, a person that a lot of people know, a lot of people watch, now voice acting for a game you love. I feel like that's pretty cool. <laughs> I mean, if she's good, she's good, but she doesn't look too interesting to me. The only thing that's funny is she has a claymore and she's like pretty small. It, it looks pretty cool to me and I kind of want to see what that happens. I really hope she's the strongest animal character in the game just for the sole reason, but <laughs> it, it will just be the funniest thing having because no one has any expectations for Sayu at all no one wants Sayu at all everybody thinks Sayu is not uh, that cool but for me she I feel like she's gonna be really cool and I, I kind of want to build her uh, to spite other people and just see the potential that Sayu has <laughs> if uh, Sayu has like, a real good potential whatever I'm gonna make the case I'm gonna show it off on my YouTube channel for my free to play account but uh, yeah I mean that's gonna be pretty much it. I had a lot to talk about this video, but uh, I'm not gonna stall for too much longer. Guys, I've been like uploading a lot and I apologize for that, but I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Consider liking this video, subscribing to the channel. Thank you guys so much for the recent support on all my videos and hopefully we can continue growing further. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in the next video very soon. Goodbye.